All right, so if you watch my other video on the Remix OS that I have currently running on my laptop, I promised that I would explain exactly how to make that bootable thumb drive. It's very, very painless. It's not intimidating at all. I didn't come up with this on my own. It's simply a write-up that I found on a website, and I'll provide all the links and the details for it. But it's super, super simple, and it really didn't take much time at all. Uh, there are basically three things you're going to need here. Um, one is a USB drive that you're willing to blow away. You're going to have to format it and erase everything that's on there. That's fine. Um, the second thing you'll need is the ISO file that contains the operating system. And I'll provide a link down below, the link that I used. Um, that's going to come in the form of a torrent. So you're going to need some sort of a torrent application like uTorrent or any of your other kind of favorite uh, torrent sites or torrent uh, applications. Um, I presume that anyone who's experimenting with this is, or anyone is an early adopter of an operating system, they have a torrent application already. These are more techie people. These aren't people who are green when it comes to technology. Uh, and the third thing you're gonna need is also a USB write tool that was provided um, in a form of a download, and I'll provide that link as well. And that was made specifically for this ISO that you're gonna be downloading from the torrent. Once you have those three things, it's pretty much downhill from there. The only thing I want to exemplify is this. My first go at making the build disk didn't work. And the reason why is it was on my fault. The write-up clearly stipulates that you need to format the drive using FAT32. And um, when I did the disk part, um, the, the command line for the disk part, and I went ahead and I wasn't really paying attention because I don't really use FAT32 anymore, I formatted NTFS. When I went ahead and built the the thumb drive using the ISO and the, the Remix OS uh, USB write utility, it came up saying successful. However, when I went to boot off of it, it kept saying no operating system found. It wasn't until I went back, killed my partition, reformatted that drive, set the partition active, reformatted it with FAT32. Then I used the USB build utility, pointed to the ISO file, it built out no problem, and I was able to boot up to it, and I'm actually running Remix OS off that uh, USB drive. So, um, as I said, I'm going to provide the links below. They're down in the description. Once you have the ISO file and once you have that USB build utility, it's as simple as just opening it up. It'll say, what drive do you want to use? In my case, I only had one drive installed, you know, USB drive, and it came up, it mounted as the F drive, and it says, is that the one you want to use? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and where's the ISO file? So I had extracted it to my desktop. I pointed to the desktop, and that was it. It took on a USB 2 drive, about four minutes or so to fully set up and configure. Where on a USB 3 drive, is, and that's what they recommend you use, um, I presume it would take probably about a minute. Um, the difference is staggering. So with that said, uh, go ahead, use the links below. Use a, Try to use a USB 3 drive that you're willing to erase. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know. It's very painless, it's very easy, and uh, enjoy.